Hey guys, what's up? My name is Prez and welcome to another episode of NHL Be a Pro. Um, I wanted to play a different game today. As you guys can see here, I got tons of games on my Xbox. I got the new Mafia Definitive Edition. I know that's pretty old. It's been out for quite a while, but I really wanted to play it. And I really want to post it to this channel. Do you guys want to see a couple of missions in Mafia and just me talking pretty much? It'd be, it'd just be type of like, it would be like a podcast It'll be a podcast type of deal regarding that. But today we're going to play some NHL 21 Be a Pro. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this. I'm actually going to take off my game headset since I'm not going to do that. Since I'm not going to play a different game, I'm going to plug in my headset so I can actually hear myself speak. So I got to plug in all the cords and everything like that to actually hear myself properly. And... I can actually hear myself talk if it connects there we go it connected perfect because with nhl 21 i don't wear my my astros i don't wear these when i don't wear let me switch to the bigger camera um i don't wear these when i'm recording be a pro or anything like that the only time i'm wearing these is when i am doing a different type of video so if we switch back to here some fancy camera movement up and down <laughs> zoom in and zoom out and um, all that stuff so i'm gonna disable the preview because the frames dropped in between there but that's okay it will come back so what team are we on we're on the winnipeg jets are we yes nhl be a pro eight this is not episode eight this is episode 61 so we're coming up to uh we're coming up to uh a pretty big I haven't made this many episodes of be a pro in quite a while I think with NHL I believe the last NHL I didn't even make it to a hundred and I think we're gonna make it to a hundred with this with this one so um, anyways today we're gonna face off against the Nashville Predators and we're gonna face off the Pittsburgh Penguins hopefully you guys enjoy this if you guys do don't forget to uh, smash the like button subscribe if you guys haven't already and I'll see you guys when we get into the second period of our first game all right guys we're gonna get started here in the second period here against the nashville predators i forgot ovechkin is actually on the nashville predators he's actually number nine on the nashville predators which i cannot believe because he's actually on the cover for obviously the washington capitals but in this be a pro he's playing on nashville so nashville has got to be a pretty good team or is good to be a pretty good team or probably going to make to the playoffs or something like that if Ovechkin's going to go to them like a player like Ovechkin um I think the only reason why probably he would go to a different team is to win another Stanley Cup but I think uh I don't know does he really want to win another Stanley Cup obviously players want to win the Stanley Cup every single year and everything like that but does he really like really want to I guess they're doing really really good in the real like in real life they're doing absolutely amazing um, than uh, the Washington Capitals. So maybe, maybe he's pushing for a cup. I think last year he wasn't really, he didn't really want to push for a cup or something like that. I don't know. But anyways, let's see what we can actually do here. I didn't score or anything. We didn't score in the um, in the first period, I believe. I was on the bench. If they, if we did score or something like that, then. Uh, well, I was on the bench, so I didn't really notice. But we are up by one, which is good. Which is good. So, that's a, that's a benefit. That's huge plus. But I forgot, I forgot that Ovechkin actually plays for Nashville in this. Which is absolutely hilarious to me. Alright guys, we are back on the ice here. Let's see if we can get a goal ourselves. Or even an assist. I believe, I actually, um, come to think of it. We might have got an assist on the goal that we actually got. Um, I completely forget. I didn't... Like, in the first period, I don't really do anything in the first period. Um, because... It's just... You guys are not going to see it anyway. So, why would I really, really play it? Um, one thing I was doing... I was mostly focusing on defense and everything like that. And getting uh, the puck out of our zone when we needed it and everything like that. Just for checking... Just like the basic stuff to to get my players some more XP. You know, I'm playing 
I'm playing it same amount of time or the same amount that I would be if I was recording, but just at a shorter period length because I shortened the period length down to uh, three minutes um, instead of like the full six minutes that I have here for recording. I put it on three minutes, so it's a little bit quicker, it's a little bit faster, um, on the ice less, so it gets the period done over with, so I don't have to, uh, so I don't have to play for too long, but it's nice, it's nice to get the XP, because the more XP that I get, the faster I can actually upgrade my player to probably the fastest, probably get to 99, uh, like, the, my, my goal is to get to 99 speed in this, and then... I'm going to work on endurance also i'm working on several different things but my main focus my main focus is speed when it comes down to it because the faster i can get down the ice the faster i can actually get goals and get penalties just like that so um that's a that's a great start that's a great end to the second period for me right there there we go zero second period is over with i'll see you guys in the third and final period when we get that started all right, guys, we're jumping into the third and final period now of game number one. And then right after this, we're going to face off against the Pittsburgh Penguins. Looks like we were just coming out of the box now, which is good. The coach wants to skate at the bench, but we got the puck. So really, no DD. We don't really need to skate to the bench, but we lost the puck there. So decided to do a line change. Why not? Let's see if we can actually um, get the lead here in this period, because we definitely need to get the lead going here because I want to win this game I want to beat Ovechkin I want to beat Ovechkin what he's playing for Nashville by the way the title is probably going to be um, Ovechkin on Nashville like question mark well obviously it's not a question mark I'm probably going to put a question mark because it makes a more clickable title but obviously I answer my own question in the thumbnail so <laughs> But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna face uh, I'm facing against Ovechkin in Nashville, which is which is a weird team. I don't think he'll actually go there in real life. I don't think there's a lot of potential, a lot of potential in Nashville um, when it comes down to a hockey team, in my opinion. That's just strictly my opinion. But hey, teach his own. If if Nashville wins, if, if, if probably any team could win the Stanley Cup this year, any team. Or well, maybe except for Detroit and Ottawa, but <laughs> despite them, maybe come on, they didn't go in. That was goal interference. Damn it! All right, I wasn't goal interference. Now we're down by one. Now we're down by one. All right, let's see if we can let's see if I can get a goal ourselves here. We definitely need to get a goal here. Oh, we got a fight. Ovechkin's fighting. Ovechkin's number nine on this, which is weird because he's always been he's always been number eight, which is weird to see him in number nine. He's the assistant captain though, though, so that's good. That's good. He's the assistant captain, and Ovechkin wins the fight. Ovechkin wins the fight. So obviously they get full energy from all their lines to the all their lines. We get about half, which is still good. It's still good for us. It still gives a little bit of energy, but. If we would have won that fight, it would have been a lot better because we got full energy. But, hey. Anyways. Boom! Oh, my God. What a rocket of a shot. Oh, my God. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see that rocket of a shot? Top quarter? Top beans? Oh, boy. That's our second goal of the night. Wait. So, I did score the first goal. Okay. So, I did. I, I completely forget. Did I score it in the second period? Man, I lose my memory with this i really do if i'm not talking about it or anything like that i completely forget so what a rocket to the top corner little turnaround top of the circle top of the face-off circle to top beans Woo! all right what does the coach have to say oh that's right our coach talked to us the first time when we got the goal forgot about that a little old school justin but i like it <laughs> you don't see windups like that in result in a goal too often anymore there we go don't worry about it <laughs> hey if it works it works right just put pucks on net just that's all you have to do is just put pucks on net doesn't matter if it's going to be a bad angle a good angle put shots on net because you never know 
even in this game, you never know that you're going to get it in. You might get it in from the frickin' goal line from the back of the net like I did the other night in EASHL. I was literally behind, I was behind the net. I wasn't behind the net directly, but it was enough behind the net where I just shot it. I shot it, and it bounced off the back of the goalie and went in. Oh, I tried to go top beans there. Try to go top beans. Couldn't do it. Couldn't finish it. Couldn't get the baked beans. But, um, yeah. So, I, try, I tried to, uh, I shot it from the back of the net. I shot it from where my character is now. Like, behind where the, like, the two goalie lines are. So, the goalie can't pass that line when he has the puck behind the net. I was, like, right there. I was right at the edge of the line. And I just shot it. I just, I was stuck in this shot animation. Which happens quite a lot with... Um, especially online. I don't really see it, like, on here. But I mostly see it online, the shot animation. You get kind of stuck into it. Um, which sucks. But I got stuck in the, sh the shot animation. And then I went behind the net. And then I shot it. My guy shot it automatically. And it just went in. It's probably one of the best goals I have ever seen. Or best goals I ever did. Was just, boom. From the shot back in the net. Just went right in. It was actually pretty funny. And then we won, I think, like, I think we won, like, 8 nothing in that game. I think we won, like, 8 nothing in that game. So the EA tilt was on for us, which um, it hasn't been happening for the last couple of games. By the way, our club, my personal club, is almost in Division 1, actually. Almost in Division 1. So we are currently um, battling in Division 2. We are, we lost to Division 2. Oh, we lost. Well, we didn't get enough points to advance to Division 1, but we got enough points to stay in Division 2, which is good, which you kind of want to do every single time. You kind of want to get enough points to stay in Division 2, obviously, and we did. So, yeah, it was a bad run the first time, so hopefully the second time we actually can get a better run in that. But anyways, that is the end of game number one. I'll see you guys in game number two in period number two. I'll see you guys when we get it started. Never mind. It is overtime. Did they tie it? It was tied. What it was. All right. Welcome back to game number one. Overtime. Um, let's see what we can actually do here. Let's see if we can get an overtime goal ourselves. Oh, he pokes the puck, but he pokes it ahead, which is good enough. Let's do the spin around pass. Oh, go. he's trying to go top beans. He's trying to go top beans with that one, boys. Top beans is going to be my new thing. That's going to be my new saying. That's what we're going to be doing new saying on this channel. Top beans. Oh, there we go. Get the puck back. Oh, absolutely. We get leveled. But we get the face off in their zone in overtime, which is huge. Which is huge. As you guys know, with overtime, we don't skip. I don't jump cut anything out. I leave everything in. So now, hopefully, we actually can get... Hopefully, we can actually finish this game and actually get the win here. Let's see. Let's see what my team can do. Come on, keep the puck out. There we go. There we go. Nice little rush. Little up the ice. Oh, he gets around defender number one. Let's see if uh, let's see if he can keep the puck. Line A with the puck. He's still on Winnipeg. Um, even though in the real life he's not on Winnipeg anymore. But we have him on here, which is thumbs up for me. Alright, let's see what he can do here. Oh, 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 leaving no holes open. Leaving no holes open. One goal away from a hat trick. Yes, that's a picture of me. Look at little, little blue circle. I don't know why they showed the ice there. That was that was absolutely weird. But I'm not a piece of ice. Let's see. Oh, okay. Okay, come on, little. Get the puck. Get the puck. There we go. All right, get up the ice. Come on, you slow bastard. Get up the ice. Oh, come on. Okay, we're on the bench. <laughs> we're on the bench. Yeah, we're on the ice now. Cover for the defense. Oh, he absolutely whiffles that. He actually just whiffled that. All right, let's see if we can get up the ice here. Let's get around this defender. Oh, we can. Backhand goal. Couldn't get it around his pad. I tried to get it around his pad there. When you're trying to go... If you go from the, the sharp angle like I, kept, like I kept on doing, you could possibly get it in. It works half the time online. So the stuff that I learned online with getting goals and everything like that, I kind of transfer them to uh, be a pro. Uh, I want to see if they actually work in this. Obviously, they do half the time, too, as well, because it's it's pretty much the same game. It's the computer goalies 
and stuff like that. Wh how did that go in? How did that go in? Did Nashville, did Ovechkin just score that? Did Ovechkin just get the overtime winner for them? Who got the overtime winner? I want to see who it was. Come on. I don't want to see him celebrating. I want to see who got goal. Who got, who got the overtime goal. Was it number nine? It wasn't number nine. Okay. All right. I'll see you guys in game number two, period two. Uh, that's a little exciting. A little exciting overtime goal or period. Whatever you want to put it as. But anyways, I'll see you guys in game number two, period number two. So you guys know how Ovechkin was playing for Nashville. Can't wait to tell you guys this. But number 88, Patrick Kane, is playing for Pittsburgh now. Yes, he is on Pittsburgh Penguins. And they just tied up with 13 minutes left in the second. We are up by two. Now we are tied. So it's a brand new game here. Brand new game. Welcome to the game, boys. Yeah, number 88, Patrick Kane, she said no, is playing for Pittsburgh Penguins. <laughs> Oh, uh, nice little, nice little, like, 2000, I think, like, 14, I want to say, 2015. Was it 15? What year was that? He was supposed to be on the cover, too, with, with Jonathan Taves. He was supposed to be on the cover with them, um, because, like, EA slogan for that NHL that year was supposed to be for, like, oh, play together, or something like that. I forget what year it was, but it's, it's... He never, he never got actually charged with it or anything like that. But <laughs> it's pretty, it's pretty funny to say that though. It's pretty funny to say that. She said no. Yeah, see right there, Patrick Kane, shot on Hullabuck. So let's see what we can actually do here. We have to get the first star of the game. That's what the media want us to do as a challenge. As a challenge, they wanted me to get the first star when they have Patrick Line or. Uh, Patrick Kane and Sidney Crosby. When I'm playing against Patrick Kane and Sidney Crosby, they want me to get star the first star. You absolutely got to be kidding me! Oh, that was almost a penalty. That was almost a penalty. So I try to get a goal in the uh, in the first period, and then um, obviously uh, that did not happen. But yeah, so I tried, tried everything. Can't get anything past Murray myself, but my team sure can. Um, so I definitely, I'm trying, so I'm trying to get the first star. I'm trying to complete that challenge, but when it comes down to it, it's going to be hard. It's going to be hard for any team actually that I play against because I actually play on a pretty good difficulty. It's actually pretty balanced. We're not winning every game. We're not winning every game. I'm not scoring on every game. I'm not getting goals or getting assist every single game. It's pretty even, which I like. I want to keep it that way. I want to keep it pretty even. Pre like, I don't want to have an outrageous like series where I get like six goals a game and all that stuff. I don't want that. I want to keep it as realistically as possible with the amount of time for the recording, like six minutes per period. I think that's pretty good length. I could probably bump it up to seven minutes, but uh, I think six minutes per period is pretty good. And I'm playing two games in one and all that stuff so it's t it's it taking me a long time to actually even edit these um i'm actually I've, i'm actually recording this on monday well it's now monday it just turned to monday um so yeah so it just turned to monday 12 o'clock um so i'm recording this on like monday morning as you would say or monday night i don't know so yeah so i'm recording this on monday it's going up wednesday and then on Friday, you're probably going to see another be a goalie. Then on Monday, you guys will see NHL be a pro. You guys can see the pattern going on here. I mentioned it in my last video. My last video was be a goalie. I mentioned that. I mentioned that uh, you guys can see a pattern going on with these videos. But when but when MLB The Show comes out in April, we still got a whole nether month. We still have to go through March. Before we start playing MLB The Show. And I cannot wait to actually play that. And actually make a series on that game. And um, today. As of today. Monday. The 22nd. I'm actually doing my taxes today. Which is. That's super exciting as an adult right. Tax season. I'm getting it done early. You don't have to get it this early. You don't have to get it done this early. Um, but I like to get it early. Get it done. Get it over with. 
get everything sorted so I don't have to really crunch it and all that stuff. So, um, yeah, so that's super exciting dolting stuff to do is pay taxes or do taxes. I don't have to pay any taxes. Well, I don't owe the government any money. That's the whole point. I don't owe the government any money or anything like that. The government actually gives me money. Can you guys believe that? The government gives me money? Yeah. Can you guys believe it? It's absolutely insane. The government gives me money. Instead of I give him money. Well, I give him money all the time. I give the government money all the time. You buy something. You're paying taxes. So, yeah. Anyways. Let's see if we can actually win this game. And not go into overtime. Surprise overtime like we did in the first game. I didn't, re I didn't really look at the score. That's... That's the problem with, with the, having the scoreboard at the bottom. I don't pay attention to it. I really don't pay attention to it. Like, if it was up above, I could see it a lot better, obviously, because I'm looking at the top of my screen. I'm looking at my screen, and I can see the top of it. But at the bottom of the screen, I, I hate having the scoreboard at the bottom of the screen. That's the one thing I have. That's what I hated about NHL 19 or NHL 20 when they first introduced this. I forget what year they introduced the scoreboard at the bottom, but I hate it. I hate it. I know some people do also hate it as well. Having it at the top, I don't know. It was having it at the top. It was always at the top of the screen, always. And then they magically change it, which kind of peed me off a little bit. But it's just a graphical change, really. Nothing to be 100% worried about, anyways. Oh my God, that went in. There we go, Patrick Line with a goal. My nose is itchy. Come on. God damn it. I hate that. I keep on mentioning that in my videos too. I hate that so much, especially when you're playing a, especially when you're playing an intense game. Like, I was really looking for the pass across there. I didn't think it would actually go in. I don't think it would actually go through. Those things you gotta really just just push through. You gotta really, you just gotta really um just just pass it and see what happens. Oh, what a nice little poke check! What a nice little poke check to get a breakaway and a goal. What a beauty! What a beauty of a goal slash takeaway. I took the puck away. That's our 23rd goal of the season. Nice little back and forth. That's all you need to do. That's all you need to do is to score in this game. Just do a little back and forth. Just a little back and forth. And then, then post it top beans. That's all you have to do. That's all you have to do. I can't believe I got that slap shot in the last one, man. That was a that was a rocket of a shot. Oh man, that was a rocket of a shot. Hey, look, he's wearing my jersey. His friend's wearing my jersey. Can you believe it? All right. Let's see if we can actually uh, get a nice little hit. Get the puck out. Keep the puck out of our zone. We're up by two. Oh, are we gonna get a second goal? Ooh, almost. We almost got a second goal, boys. We almost got one. We almost got one. All right, let's see. Let's see what our team can do when we're on the bench. Let's see what our team can do when we're on the bench. We're going on a power play, so we're going back on the ice. Not much time has passed. <laughs> Not much time has passed, but we are we are going back on the ice here. Maybe we can do another uh, another takeaway, like um, another takeaway breakaway. That's a that's a sentence. Takeaway breakaway. Let's uh. Take away, break away. Let's see if we can do one of those. Oh, line A. Line A slowing down for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, a little pass across. That didn't work at all. What? You got to be kidding me. That didn't go through. That went through. But I can't believe Shifley didn't finish it. Like, he did not get it in. Cannot believe it. All right, number 46 is just right on top of us. Jeez, give me some, like, some room here. Patrick Line with the whistle. With the missile. The whistle with the missile shot. He missed it. All right. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop rhyming. I'm going to stop rhyming. Okay. I'll stop it. All right. Let's see what our team can do. The last minute of the power play. Can we get a goal? Can we get a goal? Yes, we can. <laughs> we can. Five to two. Seven seconds left to get the first star. Did we get the first star or not? We're definitely not going to overtime with this one. We come out with a win against the Pittsburgh Penguins. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Let's see if we can actually... Let's see if we actually got the first star. Let's see if we got the first star. We probably didn't, but let's see if we did. My eye is itchy now too now. God damn it.
Let's see if we got the first star. We're not Jake Gardner. Jake Gardner plays for our team. Okay. And the first star, Blake Wheeler, two goals, one assist. Okay. We only got one goal. We didn't even get a star. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys haven't already. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Links will be in the description down below. My name is Justin. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it. And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing. Never give up, never slow, till I finally prove it. Never listen to the no's, I just wanna keep moving. Keep my head up when I act. Head up, that's a fact. Never looking back, I'ma keep myself on track. Keep my head up.